All right, so welcome back to Hess when the Fuckers plays Don't Take It Personally, Babe. It Just Ain't Your Story. Um, Part two. Yeah, last time we left off, we just completed chapter one. Um, as you can see, it is the end of chapter one, so we're going to go ahead and roll one and go straight into chapter two. Get it. All right. What does it mean to be a gentleman? Is it an outdated concept, or is there really a perfect model for a man in particular to follow that's still relevant to our times? Doesn't matter. And is that truly a good thing? No. 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 No way. <laughs> well, it, okay, well, what does he even say? It doesn't matter. Does <laughs> what matter? Being a gentleman, or is the concept of a gentleman existing in modern times with the relevancy to the modern times a good thing? All of the above, I'd say. <laughs> Yeah. Well, that's a pretty broad question. It's, a, it's, it's definitely gray. He's going the gray pretty, areas have been covered now. But. In that case, he's going pretty fucking LARP with the introspection. <laughs> I'd say so. Yeah. This, whole, this whole game goes on with the introspection LARP. Yeah. I guess. You are correct. Yeah, it's becoming a little bit hard to swallow. <laughs> hard. <laughs> it's becoming hard. <laughs> oh, just a Let's bit, see. though. According to L.J. Powell, before you can ask that question, you first have to ask one simple question. What does it mean to be... You just asked that question, motherfucker. That was the first question you asked. All right, well, whatever. Then you're already on Powell's level. <laughs> I'll jump into what Powell thinks in a minute. But, oh, there's more. <laughs> but first, what do you think it means? Just the first thing that comes to mind. Uh, I'm going to say honor and penis. Yeah, yes. exactly. Well, that's to be a man, not a gentleman. Well, as far as I'm concerned, I'm the same thing. Man. It's like saying, oh, sir, oh, ladies and gentlemen, like, it's just a descriptor for males. Is it's, it not? I mean, are you not gonna, I, I guess you would never call your choir a crowd like, oh, ladies and curs. <laughs> I guess. Or ladies and rakes. <laughs> or ladies and rakes. No, right, sluts and rakes. There you go. Sluts That's, and rakes. Boys and girls, one and all. The class pauses for longer than I'd like, given that I just threw them the easiest question imaginable. What question is that? <laughs> and break will be the first hand to go up to Charlotte's. Go ahead, just tell me anything. This is a little bit obvious, but chivalry, as in holding the door open for a woman? Yes, it is a little bit obvious. <laughs> right, right, that's definitely one. How about, okay, Taylor? I'm definitely surprised to see her put up her hand. Knowing how to be respectful to a girl. For example, a gentleman wouldn't treat a girl like crap just because they've broken up. <laughs> I stare at her. There's more than just a touch of bitterness to her voice. I wonder who she's really talking about. <laughs> this down a little bit. Yeah, no, that's way loud. Oh, yes, that's booming. Here we go. Let's drop it down to like five. Five or six. Okay. The lunch bell rings and the class starts to file out. Ariana? Oh, she's back. Yes, Mr. Rook? Oh, no. I got five. Could I see you after class? Oh, oh, shit. Thank you for the heads up, by the way. Uh, I smile, trying to let her know that nothing's wrong. I'm not going to say it in front of the class. I just want to make plans to take her out this week. Oh, my fuck. Uh, okay, so he's he's really... Wow, dude. Okay, okay so dude. let's dude. see what's going on. Oh, there's okay. some shit up, bro. Kendall is always entertaining. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, bro, what's up? You seem kind of distant, more so than usual. Things okay? Um, sorry, I've just been grappling with some personal stuff. Things have been kind of, uh, confusing lately. Actually, I'm going to ask you for advice. Of course, bro. Always. <laughs> what about? That new teacher is to snacks. Bro, bro, bro. I can't imagine. <laughs> I can't imagine what it could be. Bro, bro. Hmm. Oh, Tell me yes. I'm not the only one who saw the final of Inko last night. That was the most amazing thing. Um, oh. What's that? Oh. Charlotte. Charlotte. Not on the level. Charlotte yeah. is just... No. Doesn't know what's she's going on. Completely oblivious to every right. surrounding piece of drama. So I think she actually might be my favorite. Because she is the least stupid. They get, no, she is the most stupid. How is she the most stupid? She's completely ignorant. No, she doesn't give a shit. That's all it is. It's just like, ah, oh, people are going to be people. Whatever. Uh, she doesn't care. Whatever. <laughs> so I smell where we're going that. Sure, sure. I nod, and she turns away. And she walks away. I notice her swaying her hips. Man, what a tease. It takes me a moment to focus again. Meanwhile, I'm sticking around behind in the usual group. So, Charlotte, when are you going to forgive Kendall? Uh -huh. huh? Forgive? What are you talking about? I don't like having to avoid either one of my friends or the other. Can't you two just get back to getting along? 
I don't see why you think we don't get along. Leave it alone, Akira. Don't you think so, Mr. Rook? Wouldn't it be better if they made up? <laughs> oh, Mr. Rook don't care. Even if they kissed the made up. Oh, hell no. Don't drag me into this. No. no just too late. Pardon me. She's been pardoned. <laughs> Thank you, none of my business. Yeah, but don't you think? I really don't want to have this conversation. Isabella's giving me the dirtiest glare. That looks pretty good. This is standard revised to me. And while I have no idea how Charlotte feels, I don't think interposing is going bad. Especially not from a teacher. For reals. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. For reals. For serious. Yeah. Um, excuse me, I just remembered somewhere I needed to be. Don't let anyone else into the classroom. That's a bad idea. Kendall. Um, digital girl Enko. Eniko. Eniko? Digital girl Eniko. Oh, that's gotta be the, the previous game. Perhaps. It's the Shoujo I anime. Just finished in Japan. I can't unread this game. I'd like to unread it, but I can't. <laughs> <laughs> leaving the students in charge. It's a bad idea. Akira seems kind of. Uh, I mean, the last time I saw an Akira, it was like people killing me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so. Let's see. And before anyone else can say anything, I escape with my lunch, shutting the door behind me. The two girls can deal with Akira without me. First time he does something intelligent, probably in the entire game. Yes. I'm such a fan. <laughs> I walk away, planning to take some solace in the office, but before I even make it to the stairs, I can see another two students in the distance, and I can definitely hear. Check them. your notification. Oh, yeah. oh, here it goes. First, there's something I kind of have to tell you. Um, it's uh, kind of a big deal, actually. Kind of anxious, so uh, don't laugh, okay? Don't laugh via Facebook. Yeah, walls. Walls. Well, you don't have to be such a jerk about it. Oh, this dude with the white hair hasn't been in here for a long yeah, time. Yeah, well, he's, no, he's not done. They put him in the game for a reason. He's about to cause some shit. And he's been trying to cause shit the entire time, so he just might succeed. Be a jerk about it. Who? I'm being a jerk about it? You're the one who stood up in front of the whole fucking class to take a cheap shot at me. And you have the balls to say that I'm being a jerk? After you dumped me. Do you have an idea how humiliating that was? I didn't. You're the one who fucking dumped me. WTF, you crazy bitch. What's wrong with you? <laughs> what is wrong with you, Taylor? What's wrong with Nolan? Hold on, what's I wrong? told you. What do our notes say about Oh, Taylor? yeah. Taylor is, is an idiot. Also uh, a liar. Also lazy. And also a bitch. Crazy, crazy like bitch. That. Crazy, crazy bitch. bitch. Yeah, I didn't know what hit the Yeah. WTF, bro. Oh, shit. Yes. Uh, what, you're finally coming out of the closet? <laughs> she was trolling him. Yes, actually, that's what I was going to say. I think I'm gay. <laughs> Didn't say that coming. <laughs> I hope that he <laughs> truly is. Troll. He has to be. Troll. <laughs> Maybe not. Green sleeves. Yeah, he's yeah. yeah. Green sleeves, you are my love. You are my love. How did I dump you? What? We've had this conversation before, twice. Will you just fucking leave me alone? Oh man, no one. I, I, Look at his face now. He's just like trying to get out of this. But he's standing off his back, so Arthur, yeah. get away from me. <laughs> what is this person doing here? I don't want to be. Why do they hate you? They have a notification. <laughs> no one, I, I feel you, man. I know the crazy bitch problem. LOL, no shit, bro. I kind of already knew that. It's no big deal. So what's the problem? <laughs> He's going to get even with me. Oh, yeah. He wants the John. Uh, mm -hmm. We should definitely John go for that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's happening now. Oh, just back this away from this. Oh, uh, no, we got to step should in. Should we step? Well, you know what? He's oh, an okay. asshole already. This is supposed to be entertaining. Let's make Maybe it Maybe if we back away, they'll fight. They'll, like, actually. Nah, he wouldn't hit a woman. He's too much of a jump. Yeah, maybe she'll hit him. Ah. Ooh, okay. If I back away, I won't know. No, if you back away, you will. No, I think like back away is like, I'm going to get out of there. Like, I'm going to beat feet. Oh, uh, scoot okay. town. Well, then, yeah, step in, I guess. All right, that's interesting. I don't know, but see, the last time I thought maybe the squeezing the hand would be like, a, don't you fucking do that, and it ended up being a, like, why are you still dressed? <laughs> so, I don't know if I can say that I have any credibility. Let's step in then. Let's see uh, what's... Well, I think, listen, it, we're supposed to make these decisions 
in this sort of game based off what we would do. I would but, run away. But we're trying to think of what's going to happen if we make these decisions. Yeah. So, All right, so let's play it with you. Let's, let's just, let's no just say... No speculating about how the games are going to go. Okay, yeah. Just, let's just make it a dick. Let's just make him an asshole. Let's hear some quick arguments. Um, you want to be a dick. Yes. Uh, because... I don't know. Because it's... it's because he's proven, to, he's proven to us now that he is a dick in the first chapter. Okay, so you want us to be like true to the character the game is presenting? Yes. Okay. Um, Hunter? Yeah, what I, would you say? I would back away just because that's what I would do because I don't, I wouldn't give a single fuck about this situation. So if I was doing it the way I would do, I would back away, no doubt. If I was in John's shoes and I was like, I was in charge, essentially, these things were my charge. And I was to, you know, watch out for their welfare. And I was supposed to stop bullying uh -huh. through this, you know, messaging system. And, you know, that's just a tool. That's not the only method I can do it. So I wouldn't, you know, if I saw them in person, isn't it a teacher's duty to step in and be like, hey, you can't be doing this, at least in the hall. Like, come on. Yeah, but fuck that. Whatever. I, 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 I say fuck that. If I was a teacher, I would say fuck that. No, I'd fuck it. Let's step in. Yeah, fuck it. Just have a I was checking the message. Before we do that, let's, let's check out yeah, that. Yeah, let's, let's, let's yeah. Base, base our decision off of this right now. Why? How could you already know that? Now we figured that, like, last night. Lol. Do you didn't even... Okay, well, you didn't even... That, well, okay, that's legit. That's no bad. shit, bro. That's fair enough. <laughs> Alright, so we're stepping in. Step in. Three, two, one. I try to make my approach as loud as possible. I always, like, stop it on the pool and walk it up. Status. There a problem here? No, officer friendly. We're just. <laughs> there is definitely a problem. No one is a bitch. No, he he doesn't want to be part of it. He is he's trapped here. We're just talking, Mr. Rook. There's some things we need to work out. Doesn't sound like no one wants to talk. Is that right? No one. Yes. Notification. He's right. Ding. We got. I feel like we got to play this out. Okay. Play this it is out. the middle of a dramatic scene. Damn it, why don't you go, uh, calm down and go eat your lunch? Give the man some space. She takes a moment, probably evaluating her options. Her expression shifts back to norm, normal, calm smile. Sorry, Mr. Rook, you're right. You have this conversation at a better time. Okay, well, thank you, man. That's, what a, I mean, even, I'm sure there's some kind of spiteful bullshit going on in this. But that's a reasonable decision at the service. She skips off, or is overselling her cooperative this far, but yeah, she's definitely... Yeah, no, she, it's, she's something's about to give here in this situation. <sighs> Jesus. <laughs> Are you all right? <clears throat> yeah, thank you, sir. Well, let me know if she keeps it up. Thanks. I guess that's all there is to be said. I'm not sure what's going on between the two of them, besides the obvious, but if he doesn't want to talk, we should check our messages. Oh, okay, so there's three, three unreads. LOL, for reals, dude, everyone knows you're gay. It's the most obvious thing ever. <laughs> what? No way, you're just protect projecting because you came out when you were like 13. I'm telling you, I only figured it out. Just now. I mean, it makes a lot of sense, but no way, bro. LOL, post about it, see if anyone is surprised. Uh. <laughs> yeah, here's this up. Kendall may be my favorite character. Yeah, Kendall's the most real. Yes. Just, it is. It is what it is. Don't, just give a shit. Very single. Yeah. Alright. Wallatex. I head to the office to eat my lunch in peace. Okay. Oh, and he gets away with it. Sorry. Wait, wasn't she supposed to, like, meet up with him after class? No. To he... talk about going out? He, I think, was supposed to... God damn it, I've forgotten already. I think so. I I mean, whatever. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, it doesn't matter. I can't argue with the game, because it's about to, it's to, to do what it wants anyway. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. no, they did meet up then. We just skipped a shit ton. Okay, so we already know. Yeah, this is already uh, happening. Well, fair enough. Here I am just speculating for nothing. All right, let's get the seven notes. Never seen though. this part of time before, blah, blah, blah. Hey, here's an idea. Why don't you try not running away from our conversations? I was making a real effort to reach out. Hey, here's an idea. Fuck off. Oh. <laughs> Very mature. Sometimes I can't believe you. 
Fuck you, too. I like no one's profile picture there. He's got a great V-neck t-shirt here. He's got Evil a revolution. smile. He does. He's a douche, but he's, you know, he has his limits. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Fine, there. And the last two are just like, what? Has a big announcement to make. <laughs> He's gay. Wow, that is gay. Yeah. Congrats, that's a big step, bro. By the way, here's the context. Akira thinks everyone's going to be surprised. <laughs> <laughs> How could anyone know before I did? <laughs> no one even cares. There's no question mark after the question... Yeah, yeah he, right. he's too concerned. <laughs> All right, so never seen the part of town before. I still can't believe you've never been to Little Japan before. Of course, there's a Little Japan. Little in Japan. Japan. <laughs> it's my favorite neighborhood. I bet it is. Joe. Yeah, I bet it's it, I bet it's everyone's favorite neighborhood. It's his favorite neighborhood. It's Mr. Rogers' neighborhood. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty. Come on, I know the greatest sushi place. It'll be my treat. You're really going to want it. Awesome. Never been to Little Japan. Probably doesn't know shit about it. Definitely uh, 17, 16 year old girl doesn't know shit about sushi in Little yeah. Japan. I don't know. Now we got the awesome. Let's go check it out. This city were 15? Yeah, that's right. No, oh, they're 11th graders. Oh, okay. So they gotta be 16 or 17. Yeah. They're in the 11th grade. 18 if they fail. Yeah, well. Or if they're knows. really old and got held back or something. You know, whatever. Whatever. Uh, LOL, Taylor Gibson says. <laughs> uh, Charlotte is glad to hear that he's gay. Because she was worried that he was straight, I guess. I was wondering when you were going to come out. Congratulations. Yeah, exactly. No, yeah, back yeah. here, you're just a... You're dummy. You're dummy. Also, does he have two different... No, that's not. Never mind. Awesome. Awesome. I lead her on. I, you have to do that. The notifications thing. never stop in this game. I know. Ichigo Yamazaki. Wow. Uh, we've never seen Ichigo before. I, I think it's not uh, one of your contacts here. It must not be. Oh, there was another one. Yeah, no, uh, it was just another bullshit or comment on the status yeah. that uh, you know what I mean. Yeah. Check the 12. Yeah. No, nope, no surprise, but congratulations. Okay, so. There we go. Yep. Interested in boys, boys, boys. <laughs> oh, oh <man>. yes! <laughs> That's why it wasn't interested in a relationship, because he saw what was out there and was like, well, these guys are in this. Burning justice prevails in boys, yeah. boys, boys. The counterpart to the girls, girls, girls song. <laughs> I really only have one thought. I'm going to show her a nice, innocent time. Just a fun date, nothing more. There's no need to put something further. Than oh, there. yes, there is. There is a need. Procreation. She clings to my arm, resting her head against my shoulder. You're gonna, everyone's gonna think that she's a Yeah. <laughs> oh, well, what did your mom just say? Kendall stir in the pot. So that's, Ichigo is a male's name. Um, How do you know? Well, this Ichigo is, uh, I believe, the main character in Bleach and Guy. Alright, well, whatever. <laughs> Not this Ichigo, obviously, but I'm just saying, like, that's an odd name for a mom. Alright. Thanks, Mr. Rook. Whoa! Oh, goodness. Put this back in the frame here. Hey, there we go. That was unfortunate. You don't even want to go to no. Oh my god, FML. <laughs> 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 what to say about that. Um, it, it, twice. Monday. Oh, we don't even get to see the date? No, it's just an innocent time. Okay, an innocent sushi talk and dying. Not Only a great one. class. Can't believe what a certain, what a pussy a certain person could be. You're what a drama queen, you bitch. You are subtle. We should add the note to Taylor that she's also a drama queen, bitch. Yeah, go ahead. And yep, he has the shot on there. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. Only Taylor gets a profile. Because she's just so outrageous. Well, what, were we supposed to keep an eye on Taylor? Was that... Well, believe me, we're keeping an eye on Taylor. Okay. Even if you, that's not why I started doing it. But it works out nicely. I look like I'm more responsible now. 
Ah, two more. Uh, I didn't catch her in the act, but I think Taylor may have actually fallen asleep at one point. That's why I thought I couldn't resent her more. We should definitely hate fuck Taylor if we get the opportunity to. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Do you have any idea what's wrong with Nolan? I tried apologizing to him in the hopes of getting back together, and he just refuses to talk to me. I should not get back together. You are fucking... You are fucking borderline. Yeah, no, she's talking shit when she wants to date. <laughs> I love you, I hate you, I love you, I hate you, don't leave me, get away. <laughs> <laughs> I don't get what his problem is. I'm trying to be nice and just move on from this silly fight, but he just keeps dragging it out. He doesn't seem to be the one dragging it out. Yeah, he doesn't want to seem to also drag it out. Also, I'm going to add delusional to that list. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah. I think you are spot on with that. Oh, go on, there's another one. I actually tried to apologize. Oh, she went to everyone. She just fucking went and said all three from her. Hopefully we can get you back now. together. And can you believe it? He just runs away on me. I know he's ignoring my messages. I can't believe that guy. What did I do to deserve to be treated like this? You're a crazy bitch, Taylor. Yeah. Crazy bitch. Beyond fucking saving. I'm just glad when once uh, I'm just glad when the lunch rolls around and everyone starts to finally act like they're alive again. Well, obviously, they all skip breakfast at school one time. Of course. So how are your weekends? Let's hear in order. Charlotte first. Oh, call it wrong. God damn it. All right. I'll go in for the... Uh, let's go more to shopping. 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 Is that... Yes. Toads. 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 My goats. <laughs> Sunday was the most humiliating day of my life ever. I take it back, Charlotte. You can ignore Kendall all you want. Damn, you're getting it notifications about the ass I'm right sorry, now. but that was pretty funny. I know. OMG, no, it wasn't. Mom was embarrassing about it, but Kassan was just cruel. Who's Kassan? Uh, okay. Who is Kassan? Check your phone. I am John All right. Oh, God. Oh, yes. I'm more interested in what's wrong with you, oh. Okay, oh, yeah. fucking yeah. shit on It's why going are, down! Why are you involving me in your stupid gossip? Maybe you should try acting like an adult and just move on instead of dragging me into your bullshit. Just a thought. Heart. Yes. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Fuck you, no. Taylor. <laughs> Whoa, where did that bitchiness come from? I just thought maybe you could give me some advice because you seem like you have experience when it comes to love. You don't have to be like that. Why does Isabella have the love experience that everyone wants to know about? Because she's been in love. Nice, very mature. Yeah, Kendall. Turn it around. Kendall's still in the pot. Oh, here it goes. That sucks. He just didn't want to listen at all. So what are you going to do now? You are falling for that hook line and saying, I see three something. <laughs> oh, yeah. I have no idea. I'm guessing I'm just going to try talking to him again. Maybe when he's calmed down a little. I just wish I knew what he was playing in it. I get it. I shouldn't have started the fight to begin with. I just want to end it and make things go back to the way they were. I guess he must just be punishing me for it. I want to make things yeah, better. Yeah, yeah, I don't want to have. punish Taylor real good. <laughs> Especially <laughs> if you won't even talk to me. And we finally worked through all of that more. My other mother. That explains it. She just kept giggling uncontrollably. Wouldn't it be uncontrollably? Incontrollably. I mean, I guess that makes sense, technically. That is a valid word, but why would you not use uncontrollably? Is incontrollably a valid word? Let's I would say analyze so. it. It is a proper prefix. Uncontrollably me. means that you're un-in-control. Right. You're not in control. So, incontrollably... Oh, that means she would just like laughing. It would be the she was controlling it. It would be no, 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 no. the inverse of one control. Word. It's one. Un, it means to not, but like in control means like the inverse of controllability. Okay. Right. So, so it's a valid word. It's just why would you use uncontrollably as opposed to uncontrollably since they mean legitimately only. Do they say uncontrollably in fuck? Canada? Is this know, maybe fuck that. Maybe it's Canadianese. You're right. It it must be some kind of like French. Uh, fuck that maple syrup. Let's go on for real. Their, their flag is a joke. We kicked their ass at hockey. Yeah, except we lost them in the World 1812. Yeah, well, they burned our White House down. No, man, so yeah, they did burn the White House. Well, fuck them. Let's go burn their White House. Whatever. That's a yeah. whole different. That's a let's. That's a different one. Yeah. Let's that's. <laughs> Wait, he has two moms though. Yeah, that's why I said it makes sense. No, I mean I'm, I'm just trying to. Grab he has purple question. eyes. What yeah. the fuck is up with that? That's just red eyes, and she's got like fucking pinky orange. Okay. So it's it anime, but. 
for it. It's all the mess around this. Anyway. Hazuki, right? Not Ichigo? Yeah, right. That's Hazuki. Mom's the only, mom's the one who posted on me. I don't think you've met Hassan ever. Thank God. Is it Kason? Real talk, nigga. Real, Real talk. talk yeah. <laughs> I'm just trying to be sincere. And she's just in the game with them, wondering why I didn't, wondering how I didn't realize sooner. Yeah, real talk, dear. Yeah, real talk. All she keeps saying is, I had no idea you weren't already out of the closet. True story. My mother. It's ridiculous. Kasan, whose own coming out story is like a year long, with all sorts of detailed subplots, and will tell it on the drop of a hat, just keeps giggling at me. Okay, well, I, that seems... Pretty reasonable to me. I mean, I would probably be giggling at you. Awkward. Awkward. For reals. For reals. I'm sorry, but I started coming out on Ami. And you have to admit, it's funny that you were the last person to figure it out. Ha. <laughs> See, right? It seems... I think giggling is a legit reaction. See, I'm a punchline, bro. Well, maybe... I mean, like, I'm sorry you were slow. Yeah, he is a punchline. My sexuality is just one big setup, and it's not just, oh, well, well, you're gay. It's, oh, well, everyone else, but you knew you're gay. You used to have dignity, and now you have BS. No, you never had dignity. You just now realize that you I mean, never I, had it. Yeah, you wouldn't really probably born dignified. No, no, definitely most not. Most people aren't. That's not true. That's He's not true. <laughs> <laughs> They're saying the same things that we are. I, I'm hey, telling you, this is two shirts every now. Woo, yeah. I'm gay. If it makes you feel any better, I didn't know you were gay. It's been out before I read it about your profile, anyway. And now the entire world... Yeah. Boys, boys, boys. Yeah. It doesn't. You've known me, what, a week? True enough. So what you gonna do now? Oh, shit, I didn't even know that six months ago. Oh, man, we gotta oh, check. Yeah. This is a shit storm. What are we gonna do now? We're gonna check the, uh, Amy Lol, well, you mad. <laughs> Here's my advice. Get over yourself, and then get over him. Oh, In that order. fuck. Oh, uh, hold on. We've got a uh, potential portal here. Okay, so, sorry about that. Um, there was a bit of land or trouble. We've got taken care of this. We're all good now. Uh, back to the action. So, um, we've got some messages. Let's check those out. Yeah. Uh, we got Ariana saying some shit. Oh, God. Ooh. This shit again. Uh, Taylor Gibson, I have no idea. I'm guessing I'm just going to try talking to him about that. Um, I guess all I can do is wait, really. I'm sorry, though. That's awful. She does indeed awful, Ariana. Fuck Taylor. It's awful. She's a, what is she? A crazy bitch whore? Yeah, crazy bitch whore. Why are you Oh, she see? is a delusional, lazy yeah. bitch, drama queen, delusional, and also a liar. Okay, so that's where we're at with Taylor right now. Yeah. Yes, Taylor is all this right. Is more uh, what's, what's the good kid up to? Kendall's funny. <laughs> I don't know if you realize this, Kendall, but normal girls don't like pussies. Maybe that's it. He's oh, like, man. Ooh. Uh, Wall, you mad? Oh, now he's a mature. Wall, you mad? She mad, Taylor. I want to point out the added question mark. Like, I'm really asking. She's this. really mad. She mad. She actually is mad. She that's the question, isn't it, says Akira? Well, I'm happy you figured it out. You two, well, they're all supportive in their own jocular way. Yep. It's a big step. I had trouble myself when I first met Kendall. Oh, yeah, I remember. Actually, speaking of Kendall, I'm going to ditch on you guys. I actually made plans. Is that cool? <laughs> no, of course, I won't think less of you if you go spend time with your best friend. Don't be silly, go ahead. All right, well, your words contradict yourself. But, you know, we've already established. Oh, man, more wall, you mads. Oh my god, you are the biggest bitch, you know that? Whoa, you mad? Three question marks. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> Alright, I actually want to see, is there any more, um, 12chan? Oh, no, there's no, there's no 12chan. That's a pretty unused feature. Yep. Yeah. I give up, you're impossible. I'm waiting for another, you mad. Uh, nope. And, alright, thanks. Later. Three ditches. Oh, that boy. He's kind of adorable, isn't he? No way. <laughs> <laughs> well, all right, Hunter, pass on the judgment. Apparently not. I don't mean it that way, just that he's really funny. He should just get wound up tight. <laughs> well, you heard what his mother's like. That's true, isn't it? He must take after her more than he'd like to think. Quite possibly. Isn't that the story of a lot of gay people, though? Yeah. Uh, every boy takes after his mother more than more than he likes to think. John, 
popping in with the comments. I think John might be gay as well. Is that so? Oh, I yeah. suppose it makes Are you calling sense. it right now? I'm trying to make him gay if we can do it. <laughs> John is on the quest. All right. For a gay John. Gay John. I can understand not that. Just a, just a gay raper. <laughs> that, that, not just guys. a normal raper. A <laughs> raper. A raper. Not a rapist. <laughs> not a rapist. No, he rapes. He's a raper. A raperizer. <laughs> yeah, he raperizes. <laughs> He's a raper. He's a raper. Concentrated rape. All right, what's Isabella got to say? Uh... Hey, here's on his way now. Sorry that he's late. We ended up distracting him a bit. What? what? Do you mean he's not going to meet with you? Do you know where he just went? Oh, man, he's got himself a gay lover already. Oh, yes. Ooh. Uh, ooh, ooh. Thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> no problem. See, no one. He, I'm telling you, that guy's not as bad as he can have to He's just trying to get along. Hey, he's not going to see Kendall. Okay, so if we weren't paying attention to this shit, we would have not understood what he was being said. It'll probably give us another prompt to look at the look at the yeah. Nope, I'm not his babysitter. I don't keep track of his whereabouts. Sorry, sis. Sis. Oh, how do you know? Okay, I just asked. Huh, I wonder where he's going then. I don't know. I think Kendall does, but it's being difficult. Oh yes. I guess you're right. Thanks, though. I'm really glad you're willing, actually willing to talk, though. Everyone else has just been awful. Even Isabel was just nasty. I'm really <laughs> glad to have you as a friend. Thanks. Okay, man, this is... I hope everyone comes in with a no, we're not friends. This is very high school. Yeah. Kendall, difficult? Well, I never. <laughs> I've definitely never heard that kind of sarcasm from her before. No, you know, she's got her, uh, her own feelings. Uh, I'm sorry to hear that. It's not like you need a hug. Yeah. <laughs> so she didn't even know. You need, what Taylor needs is one of those I am loved pins. Yeah. Cool. She needs, yeah. Uh, she needs it now. By the way, this video. Reminder. Last video is sponsored by many things. This video is sponsored by Old Navy. Uh, <laughs> you are loved. Everyone who goes there. <laughs> go ahead. Don't go to Old Navy. You're, you're yeah, you gotta go into Old Navy for the shit on Super Bowl deals and the printing machines. I haven't been to Old Navy yeah. in a while. That's probably why I feel like. I have honestly never real, been to though. Old Navy in my life. Well, good for you, Donnie. You know, it's not really that old. It doesn't resemble a navy very much. Yeah, it's it's pretty bad. Some of the clothes are bad navy. place. They're navy kinda, in the in the color sense. Yeah, they're ripping you off all over town. Yeah, they are. It, yeah. Except for their shit on like closeout deals. Yeah, some of those can be up like two dollars shoes. Yeah. Oh snap, two dollars shoes. Yeah. I might have to hit that up. Yeah, these yeah. are like flip flops. Yeah, they're flip flops. No, but, well, yeah, fuck they're, that. Thomas says shoes very loosely. Yeah. Okay, whatever. I mean, I guess they are shoes. I they are shoes. They go on your feet. Yeah. Well, I mean, they're socks and shit. You know. Whatever, you can wear socks yeah. and flip-flops. Flip -flops. You can. Yeah. <laughs> no. You can. You could. You wouldn't want to. No. What, are you German? <laughs> Fucking socks and flip-flops. Another teacher is behind. I can actually see flip-flops and later hosen. Oh, yeah. <laughs> flip-flops and later hosen all day. That's all uh, Germans wear, by the way. My brother. Uh... Dirty, Dirty Mike, Mike yeah, yeah, is uh, in Germany right now on a college soiree uh, with his fiance. He he informs me that all Germans do wear later hosen. Uh huh. And, and flip flops. Uh, and flip flops. And flip flops with yeah. socks. Yeah, with socks. And uh, they're all into polka very heavily. Yeah, yeah which is why uh, our band is in now polka. Have you ever heard the yeah. polka raps? They're ridiculous. Yeah. Well, we invented it, so yes, duh. Roll out the barrel, man. Who invented the snare pop? I think it was us, wasn't it? Yeah, on the moon. Was sure. that? It was on the moon. <laughs> was that the one we faked in '69? Yeah, you one? know, it was the one we faked initially. That was the first like snare pop, but we eventually. <laughs> but did it was do a proto. It. We eventually did do it for real. Though. The reverse, yeah. the reverse snare pop mm -hmm. on the moon. Yeah, we also did the reverse bass. <laughs> Uh, the strings were actually just backwards. Yeah. I uh, made it easier for our cerebral palsy friend uh, to play the bass. He was still bad, though. He is still oh. bad currently. Speaking of which, my two cohorts, uh, the owners of Donzilla D&G, owners, operators, curators, and inventors, um, they're offering a special right now. Uh, they will give free bass lessons, 100% off of the normal fees, uh, so long as you are willing to be in the band, work hard, be reliable. Uh, this is downright dirty, the band, downright dirty. They need a bassist. They will teach you for free if you're willing to be good at the bass. 
You have to be ready and willing, though. Yeah, no, you, you have do. to. I mean, it, they, the thing is, you pay up front, and then they refund it after you successfully manage it. Yes, of course. Yeah. Um, but still, that's pretty sure on deal, because they normally charge, like, 50 cents a lesson, so... This video is sponsored by uh, Gonzella D&G. Yes. yes. We have, a, we have a great special out right now. It's 90% off any quadriplegic. So, hit it up. All you have to do is use promo code uh, HESMAN816 at gonzoadngfacebook.com. Yep, just leave it in the comments uh, or wall posts or whatever, and they'll get right back to you. All right, let's get back to the shit. Yeah, shape. back to the shit. Um, another teacher is blowing an office right now, so I'm forced to spend my prep period in the classroom instead. Wow, oh, shares an office? That sucks. Uh, let's see what uh, these guys have to say. Hey, what up? Sorry about the whole awkward thing in the cafeteria earlier. Not my finest hour. It's okay. It's okay. We all have awkward moments. So uh, I saw your post about coming out. Congratulations. So what did you want at lunch? I'm um, sorry. I hope I don't mind me distracting you. Uh, okay. Akira is definitely going after the no. <laughs> huh. It's what a bad. weird response. Yeah, really. It been <laughs> not, kind of a non sequitur there. Not that I get any prep actually done. Are you just even masturbating? <laughs> I just keep me distracted by my computer. Yeah, right so now. he's definitely masturbating. I don't know, he's to keep up on the, Yeah, he's, he's Facebook yeah. masturbating. All right. No problem. Like, I care about math. This class is the worst. Sup, man? All right. That was my emphasis there on the man. Man. In case you can't read. <laughs> no no hate on the illiterate folk. Um, just fucking pick up a bug. <laughs> man? Make my life easier. Man. I don't know why the school uses these things. Is this why the students have such a hard time engaging because they're too busy chatting online? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, probably. Mm -hmm. Probably definitely, definitely that. Yeah. I mean, definitely that's why it is. It's also that your curriculum probably sucks dick. Most <laughs> likely a bad teacher as yeah. well. Yeah. I mean, you are, you are an ex-computer person. You've already been on this so. now. Even if they're ostensibly... Even if they are ostensibly for typing notes and storing... Okay, all right. This is awkward word. It seems ridiculous. Compare that to how it was when I was in high school. There was nothing like that. Well, that's because you lived in the Stone Age. Uh-huh. Back in, uh, you know, you grew up in, like, 1995. Well, it's, if it's 2027 and he's, like, 30, I'm guessing, right? So he's been through two marriages. Yeah. So he would have to have been born, like... In the 8th? No, if he was 30 yeah. in 2027. He's 30? Oh, okay. Well, Shit, man, I'm older than him yeah. in this story. I am older than this man. We would all be older than him in this story. So he would have to be born in like... Shit, I'm the old for up. I don't even know what game he is. Like, I, bet uh, I, call it, I bet I call it the Googles. Definitely the Googles. Pulled up the Googles on my computer and went to the Book of Faces. Uh, Akira says, sorry, it's been kind of difficult to write. It's hard to say this, and I'm not really good at this sort of thing, but, well, I guess I'm just going to have to say it. I like you, Nolan. You oh, don't get yes. credit for it, but you're obviously a really smart guy. You don't put up with bullshit at school. You don't care about how many friends you have. Man, I fucking sound gay. I've just defended them, and he's doing the same thing. Uh -huh. <laughs> you're even willing to stand up to Taylor. You're very cool, and you're, not, and you're also very hot, and I admire you so much that it was embarrassing the fuck out of me even thinking about telling you how I feel. I don't know you all that well, but there is nothing in my heart that I would like more than to change that. So, I'll understand if you're not comfortable and don't want to talk to me again. I know this seems out of the blue, but I've, been, I've spent a long time trying to figure this out, and I just can't hold it any longer. It ain't any longer. So you spent all of yesterday? Uh -huh. And I just figured out you were gay like the night before, right? Yeah. So, you've put a lot of thought to this, bud. Um, I don't mean... Oh, there's more! Oh, shit! So that's what I wanted to say. I like you. Would you like to hang out sometime? I just really wanted to get to know you better. I guess that turned out long. Sorry, thanks for bearing through it. Now, you don't know if you're bored. Oh, that's yes. Right. I want to know the update on this. Mm -hmm. Too long didn't read. TLDR, I want your nuts. <laughs> oh, we're After wedding. school. Bum, bum, Is this the special? Bum. <laughs> oh, I can actually just make the text disappear for a pure white screen. Nice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's functionality I like. That is. Even if it's worthless, Let's I can Let's admire the white screen for a second. Mm. Oh. oh, well, fuck me. I already clicked. It's all right. That's it for the new... That's it for the day. I've packed up my stuff, and I'm heading home now. Oh, here we got some messages. Oh, yes. Oh, it's not even them. Oh, oh it is. yes. I like you. That's pretty Emmy. Gave me a day or two, okay? I need to think about it. Okay, so he's already... The, he's thinking about it. Of course, I tell it's in the stand. Take her time. Take her time. Take her time. Take her time. It's a very redneck way to say it. Hey, hey it's time. Time. Or, or maybe not. Maybe not. Hey, Noel, what's up? Uh, hey, you know how you said if we ever had a problem? Um, I mean, I, can I ask you for some advice? Sure, what's the problem? Not now. I mean, it's a big thing. Can we talk tomorrow? 
I can't tell if he's being weirdly evasive or shy or just straight up confused. I still don't really have a very good impression of him, I guess. Yeah, because he had, he's been... Aside from his shitty attitude. Towards his studies and apparently being Taylor's ex. Well, I mean, whatever. He's a, you know, a teenage boy. A shitty attitude towards his studies is the bar. <laughs> Pretty much. None of that really helps me out here. No, it doesn't. Of course. Why don't you meet me in my office this time tomorrow, then? That's good. Yeah, thanks, sir. Bye. Weird. This is going to be awkward as hell, I'm guessing. <laughs> I, yeah, I think you have. Oh, we just skipped the entire yeah. Yeah. the next day. It's convenient how all this drama happens in very episodic fashion, uh, with convenient timing. Yep. This, I'm telling you, this is an idealized world. That's it for the day. Well, as far as classes go, blah, blah, blah. No one's probably on his way to my office before I go take a break to see if I'm going to do 12 channel posts. Oh, yeah. I was wondering. There's probably a better way to get to 12 channel, but that's how I do it. In this thread, your favorite Sailor Senshi. What the fuck is in Sailor Moon? Opie here, starting off. Usagi, for reals. She's lazy, she doesn't give a shit about school. She's worthless on her own, turns out to be badass anyway. Story of my life, she's fucking awesome. I'm Usagi for my stream, in life. You just think you're a lazy piece of shit, turns out to be badass, or... Um, wow, really? Okay, bro, that's kinda weird. I always like Amy best. She's shy and really smart and a cocky wish so I could always relate to her. That's what I was thinking. Oh. Uranus. I would tap the hell out of her. <laughs> well, you mad. The 388? Yeah, you mad? Seriously. Seriously mad. <laughs> oh, you were never like Amy, bro. What the fuck are you talking about? Look at those fucking books. Amy was smart because she studied in class. Now, she's an equal student. You probably think you're too smart to pay attention in class. You read the nine instead. Yeah. <laughs> this song that's playing right now, I just noticed, is a remix from Super Mario Life Are you sure? I'm positive. Really? It's, yeah. I was. I noticed how good it was, but I didn't make it anything up. It's not. Uh, they put out an album called Heavy Trooper. It's ready to launch. Oh uh, that's fan <laughs> remixes of the music from the game. Wow. Okay. Uh, let's see. Probably you think if you smart to pay attention to class, you read manga instead. She wasn't the nerdy one in the group because she spent all her time alone playing video. She was the nerdy one because she was too busy studying the fuck out. You're saying that's you? They they put video in there. Yeah, I guess not. You're right. Uh, but I still fucking hate you, Sonny. She's so goddamn obnoxious. She's the worst part of the show. Fuck you, Sonny. Oh, so what you're saying is you'd like to be angry. I think it was actually smug because you secretly thought she was too smart to bother. So we don't apologize for studying the test. <laughs> uh, 12 channel, excuse me. 12 channel. When you put it that way, no. I would fucking hate her too. Characters like that in fiction piss me off so much, even if they really are just like me. What does it even mean? Oh man. Self hate. Laughing Moon Woman. You mean you're psyching for what? Oh, 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 yeah, <laughs> terrible. It's terrible. The probably the Get worst out of here. I've ever seen. Get out of this 12 channel. Yeah, yeah, fuck that. Yeah, this is stupid. I love it, but I hate it. <laughs> well, I jumped on late for the Time to go, Bartleby. Oh, 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 hey, hey sir. sir. Uh, no one. Why don't you have a seat? Right over there. I'm Chris Hansen. <laughs> and we'll talk about what you were having trouble with. He sits down. He doesn't. Yeah. Not sitting. Uh, followed by the worst awkward silence of my entire life. That is... He's trying to bring himself up to saying something, I can tell, but he clearly can't. Okay. Predictions. He likes the teacher, and is conflicted because the other guy likes him. And he's like, oh man, I can't, I gotta be true to my heart. That sounds about right. I'm thinking, I'm calling that as well. That's, that's what's happening. Alright, two votes. That's all we can hope for, is what I'm saying. Yeah. Wishful thinking. That's the best case scenario. Come on, say something, bitch. I should have been there. <laughs> uh... Oh, oh, so yes. Yes, I should. oh, yes. Wait for him to answer on his own. Make him not be a bitch. Yeah. Wait, make him not Yeah, be these bitch. things give... That, yeah, 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 that's that. presumptuous. That gives away that you know things. Uh -huh. That's... I mean, hopefully he's able to fucking ball up. Yeah. Take your time. Well, it's Kira. Kira asked me... Okay. Yeah, it's just I'm shocked. I'm just shocked. I don't know how to respond. Uh, how do you respond to that? How do I respond to that? Why? That's a principle. That's why he's shocked. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. This is a progressive society. He should not have a problem with gay people. No. Yeah. Why are you so shocked? The thing is, um, I don't know how to say this without sounding pathetic. It's okay, I'm not going to judge. I promise you will. You will see the way judge. Look at that. You have the yeah, wise, you have the wise judge face on. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 
I have, I have got to get him to open up. I try to think. I need to convince the guy that I'm not going to think less than if I miss something emotional. How the fuck do you do that? I don't know. I don't know. Fucking admit something yourself. I think it's straightforward. You're a 16 year old who doesn't pay attention in school. I couldn't think less of you. There's no way going to help him if it's honest. <laughs> I like him. I yeah. like this guy. This is Maybe I could say. Hey, look at me. I'm a twice divorcee. I'm 38 years old, and I've only gone into the teaching of some sort of bizarre midlife crisis, okay? That's how you do it. That was pretty uh, wide open. You don't have to worry about seeming pathetic to me. Trust me, I know the feeling, and I'm the last person in the world to judge you on it, all right? Huh. Okay. Fair enough, sir. You got through to him. That's how you talk to a kid. You be honest. You treat them like a person. It's just, I don't know if you've noticed, but I don't exactly have any friends. No, I'm sad. Not even when I was dating Taylor, not really. At least I didn't pretend that was part of our huge social network, but hell, yeah, it's just me. So you just want a friend? Yeah, no, not really. <laughs> it's not like I'm desperate. I don't want to say yes to him because I'm desperate to be close to someone that's pathetic. And then there's pathetic. And what? My sister. He likes me. He barely knows me, but he feels so strongly that he's going to embarrass himself with a chance to get closer to me. For me? For me? What the fuck is up with that? He pauses. It's a weird one of thought, but at least he's finally actually saying what he thinks. Then I thought, maybe it's his desperation. There aren't that many boys at the school. But look at him. He's hot, man. I don't mean, I don't, you know, I'm not gay. I'm not attracted to men. It's just objectively, right? You know what I mean? He's definitely gay. He doesn't want to admit it. Probably not the kind of boy who would have trouble finding someone. That's it. I mean, fuck, if he wanted, he could probably have any fag in the world he wanted. I don't think he's desperate. Uh -huh. So what do you think, then? I don't know. That's that's the thing, sir. I don't know. It confuses me. I just can't wrap my mind around it. And I, well, I don't know what to do. I guess that's where I'm asking for advice, sir. I stare at him. He's asking me what he should do. How the hell should I know? I assume this probably going to be something simple, something understandable. Bowling, I can get. His ex being a jerk. I can definitely get. Him needing to pick it, pick it up on the academics, I could give a whole speech on. But yes. I guess there's only one thing I could do. Why don't you just give it a shot? Yeah, dude, actually, that's my yeah, legit answer. Yeah, go for it. Well, honestly, it's kind of hard to put myself in your shoes, but... No pause. I should get my words right. The way it seems to me is... Do you really have anything to lose by saying yes? <laughs> I mean, do you really think he's going to push you into anything you don't want? No. Probably not. So he's not gay, but he's going to date a man. Dick move. It would be a dick move. Ah, uh, but I don't want to lead him on. That would be a dick move. So don't lead him on. So, he stops to think about it, although it occurs to me that he's already made up his mind. He probably did a while ago. He just wanted someone else to confirm it for him. So you tell him you're interested in him, so long as he doesn't push him into anything. I mean, that's true, right? Yeah, I guess so. I mean, really, it's not that I'm attracted. It's just, who wouldn't be interested in that? So he is definitely attracted. Uh, I sure wouldn't, but I don't say that. <laughs> well, don't just go off my word, but it sounds to me that's what you think you should do. I guess so. There's a long silence. There's not really anything more needs to be said, is there? Just one big pause. So I should just talk to him. Yeah. Okay, you're right. I should just talk to the guy. Tell him. All right. Thanks, sir. That was helpful. I think. I think I've got a pretty good idea of what I'll say. How it'll go, I have no clue. But trust me, I'll. When it comes to these sorts of things, I don't think anyone has a clue how it'll go. Uh, yeah, the people who know if they're gay or straight or not, that's how they will know it. Well, in the short term, maybe. <laughs> All right. Well, because I mean, you never know how shit's going to turn out. I think you pretty much know... By the time you're 17 or 16, by the time you're a junior in high school, you pretty much know if you're gay or not. Well, I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about, like, what's going to happen when he has this conversation with me. Oh, yeah, I know. But, I mean, if he if he's gay, then go for it. If he's not, then don't. How hard well, is that? Well, fuck, I didn't figure out much about it. I was, like, 20. Really? Yeah, but I'm stupid. <laughs> what took you so long, dude? Just figuring out the exact details of it. Oh, the exact details? Yeah. Did just have a gut reaction? Not really. Did just have a... I don't know, lower than gut reaction? No. <laughs> as clever as that is, no, I didn't. All right. 
so it was just soft the whole time. Like everything, <laughs> everything that was presented to you was just like, ah, this does nothing for me. Well, yeah, I, mean, I was, I was, I mean, I not was kind of am like asexual to an extent. Okay. And so it's uh, so everything is shit. There's, well, yeah, exactly. I hated everything so much. Like, oh, yeah. I couldn't even find myself like. There were sexual urges. It was all about like I wanted to date somebody. Everybody around me was fucking terrible. Just everyone. Oh uh, yeah. And the people who weren't terrible were either taken or not. I'm not interested. In. So there's no uh, <laughs> no limit between the physical and mental attraction between a person. They're they're not connected. They're not connected. No, they're not connected. So there was no reaction of your wiener to anything purely physical at all. There was, but it was always like you know just fucking base reactions. Yeah. And those were not consistent. Oh, they weren't consistent? No. Okay. So that might have... Still not, they're still not consistent at all. Uh. Anyway, <laughs> real talk. <laughs> yeah, real talk. As we had earlier, now we're doing our own. Uh, I guess that's all, so I hope it goes well then. See you. Yeah. Bye, sir. There he goes. I hope my advice wasn't too terrible or pushing it, but honestly, I'm pretty sure I just told him what he wanted to hear. Yeah, you're a yes man. <laughs> That's probably all they needed. What a strange, strange evening. What a strange, strange game this is. Yeah. The class is staring intently at the handouts I just sent them, or at least I sure hope they are. It's hard to tell when they're always staring at their computers. Well, yeah. Uh, okay, so they're staring intently at the handouts, and they're staring intently at the, Okay, okay, so it must be a digital handout. It's anxious. Anxious. Understandable. Remember, the items listed are only suggested, so as long as it's 2,500 words or a five-minute presentation, you can do whatever you find interesting. Anything that's at least 2,500 words? All right, okay. Taylor's going to be a big bitch about this. Okay, let me be perfectly clear. This is a grade 11 class, and I'm letting you have fun with this. Don't give me any bullshit. He is not fucking around. If you think it's cheating, then it probably is, and I'm not going to give you a good drink. If your heart's into it, that's fine, but be smart. Not clever. Is that understood? Yes, sir. Yes, she was planning on being a smart ass. Which, amen. Now, okay, hold on just a moment. That's all for today. For homework, you have a reading response, and please think about what you'll do for this assignment. Of course, no the bell rings, everyone but Charlotte stops paying attention. Of course. But I can try. The class starts to file out, but slower than usual. Oh, yes. All right, before we get into this... Yeah, I was going to say, check that shit. It'll be okay. Fido! Fido? What's that shit? Just, you know, fight! Fido! I don't know, a dog's name. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, Kira is pleased. And sweating, I guess? Huh. He always kind of responded. They both look like they're going to a funeral. Yeah, they do. Yeah. Except for the outfits. Oh, not I want to know what happens, Not enough though. Johnny Cash. Uh, hi there. So much of them, I'd like to talk to you about uh, what you said the other day. Wait, here? Oh, no, of course not. Uh, I thought um, we could go somewhere more private and eat lunch. Oh. Oh. For reals? It's complicated, but yeah. For me. <laughs> awesome! So, what did you have in mind? <laughs> for reals. They walk off together. And, and, and. I wish. No, no way. way. She's shocked. Charlotte's just bemused, I guess. <laughs> Did he just... Those two? That was what I thought it was, right? Let's not start any gossip now. There's any for that. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I think they both have enough problems right now without having the whole class talking about the behind their back, don't you think? Sorry. You're right, of course. And she's just back to the emotionless husband she normally is. Mm -hmm. um, I have no idea what to make of the two of them. No one obviously has no idea what he wants, and it's probably going to be more complicated relationship than the Kira wants. Amen. If there's anything between the two of them, it's going to be crazy. There will be tons of drama, and it's probably going to make things worse for both. And you fucking spurred it on. <laughs> we spurred it on. Anyway. Still, I couldn't help but notice that as they walked out together, they both had the biggest smiles I've ever seen from either. Well, fuck yeah, good for that. End of uh... chapter two. Oh, man, it should be... Uh, All right. Yeah. Off right here. Yep, we're going to clip it here. Uh, we'll be back with Chapter 3. At some point, you won't notice any difference because we're all going to get uploaded once. Uh, so until then, until then... All right. Yeah. Yeah. The it was a good one. Signing chapter off. 2 was great. Peace. The fuck. Goodbye.